disunity and conflicts. Welcome, good day and hello to Silent Time, the opportunity to think on what is really important in life. How comes that there is so much disunity and conflicts, even when there is belief in God, where people trust God and follow his word? On the other hand, there seems to be even more peace where people do not believe sometimes. Often people are in a false peace because there the devil can sleep. When people do not believe in God, when they do not understand that they need forgiveness, when they only look at themselves and do not expect anything from God, there is no trust, no belief. And there seems to be a false peace sometimes, a temporary false peace. But when people start to understand that they need forgiveness, and they turn to God and ask for his grace and start to put their trust in him, then the devil stirs up the people against each other. He sends people who persecute as it has been at all times. At all times there have been martyrs, and especially in the beginning, at the times of the apostles, they also had to suffer and people were fighting and having disunity between each other. Matthew 10, Jesus says, verse 34 to 36, Do not think that I have come to bring peace to the world. No, I did not come to bring peace, but a sword. I came to set sons against their fathers, daughters against their mothers, daughters-in-law against their mothers-in-law. Your worst enemies will be the members of your own family. On all society levels, that is true. From the family level to the inter-country level. But finally, when we continue to believe and expect from God, put our trust in him, believe his forgiveness and fully rely on that good news, God will give us real peace, not a false temporary peace, but a true inner permanent peace. Lord, we thank you for all that you give, even in difficult times, in times of persecution, of disunity and of conflicts. You are still there and we know that you are the creator of the world and the Almighty. You have the highest power, no matter how people or devil or enemies fight against. You are stronger. Thank you that we can put our trust in you and that you promise us your eternal true peace. We praise you forever. Amen.